everybody welcome back and in last week's video we looked about the man the prof the daniel prophecy about the man for the man of sin period which was times times and dividing of time which we also knew as 42 months and what also can be said as 1203 school days and we can also say that there's 1260 days but in today's video we're going to start something about a different part of the second presence topic so what we're going to talk go into now is a period when the last apostle john's period has finished and the early church period this is the roman empire period where they completely dominated the world and completely ruled it after the greek empire empire because in those times they completely dominated and had complete control to even change religious systems which is the key point we're going to look about today which we'll go into further detail so First of all, the time period we're going to look about is the period of the Roman Empire, Constant Constantinople. Constantinople, the Roman Empire. And his period was around, not, we don't know exactly, 250 to 330 AD. And in this period is where, but in the 4th century is where he turned, turned into Christianity. And luckily it's recorded since this 4th century period, the Bible actually was actually written before this, since we're talking about period after the early last Apostle John. So we have complete knowledge about this. So we need to understand about this period now. So we're going to learn about this and see how it's reflected in this history. But since it's in modern days now, we can easily find out how this has happened. So now we're going to look into the history of this. So how this all started was in a crucial war. So in the crucial war, constant Constantin, even Constantinople, even like knew that in this crucial war he he was going to lose. But in a vision, he saw the a cross, and then he believed that he won the war because of this. So then he was really curious about what this cross was, and then he found out he was something to do with Christianity. So after this, since he had full cover, oh, like, like let's say power over the roman empire since rome is in italy so and we have the israel they're controlling there so in all parts of where rome are now rome are ruling he's the most powerful and he say that they should all change the religious system into christianity he's saying so he changes the whole system about christianity here so this is how it changes and this is where it completely alters the time period of this so well when the constantinople gets this period he tries to make this christianity christian christianity period christian period for them as a religion happy for them so what he tries to do he tries to put the fleshly desires in this so they so the focus though of this like the focus of the god's kingdom and the second presence was completely lost and the fleshly desires what constantinople brought up started to develop since then he started to make man-made festivals such as jesus christ's um birthday his death day which we call as easter and all of these festivals to corrupt and make them forget and unfocused about jesus christ's second presence but these were not supported or made by the early christians or the early church these were man-made festivals being made and we're going to look more about this and we're going to look about trinity next week so see you then bye